Hi, I'm Peter. I'm an instructor with Centric Training. And I want to talk to you for just a second about some stuff we're going to be teaching in the IT Admin 2 class uh, when you're here at Centric. And what I want to talk to you about is how does your computer get information to talk on a network? Um, well, this is how it works. First of all, you have a network. And your computer is on the network. It looks kind of like that. Well, probably not exactly like that. And then you have a server on the network called a DHCP server, Dynamic Host Configuration Protocol. And it gives your computer addressing information so it can communicate on the network or on the internet. And so the first thing that happens is your computer boots up and it makes a request. It goes out to the, the network and says, hello, any DHCP servers, please help me. I need addressing information. And that is called a discover. First part of my acronym, D. The next thing that happens is any DHCP servers on the network hear this cry for help and respond. I could help you. And they make an offer. This is the O. This is the second step in a, in a DHCP uh, configuration. The third thing that happens is, after he's responded to me, I now make a request for addressing information. That is the R in our acronym. <laughs> now the DHCP server, the last thing he does is say, oh, he really wants the information. So he gives it to me, he acknowledges the A, he acknowledges my request, gives me the information, says, here's your IP address, go forth on the network, go out on the internet, talk to your friends, and have a great day. So, this is how it works. So DORA is our acronym for remembering how DHCP works. And I'm really looking forward to teaching you how to manage this awesome technology when I see you here in class. Thanks.